what is up guys it's a wanted turtle and today we're doing a Yu-Gi-Oh opening we are opening savage strike again just because savage strike has been by far the best to us and while doing and dabbling in finny chasers and arena lost souls was fun it just wasn't very rewarding so we're going back to savage strike where we can we've had great luck pulling phantasme four times and uh, actually i did open a box off or on camera but i ended up losing the content through a just some data corruption uh and i was actually really poor so to be honest i, I think i feel like our uh great win streak is over however um doesn't mean we're going to give up and so we're going to try again with savage strike pulling hoping for another phantasme we are i guess batting 800 now versus a thousand that's still really good. <laughs> Although I'm not a baseball person, uh, but I'm pretty sure that's really good. All right, 12 packs of Savage Strike. Let's see, we want Phantasme, obviously. Um, I feel like this camera's a little close. Borload Savage Dragon, Pot of Extravagance. We still have yet to pull one of those. The Psychic Wielder. I think it was one more ultra rare, but I can't remember what it was. All right, let's do this. Good to be back in the set. Time Thief Bezel Ship. Sure, new style Slemony. Back to these crazy names. Child Play. Catch Eve Level 2. And then Guard Dragon Pisty for Secret Rare. And then Apple of Enlightenment for the regular rare. And then we have Foxer, Subterra Secession, and Extra Ceratops. Let's see, we also want multiple of the Salaman Great um, Sunlight Wolf because that is in the rare slot so pulling multiple in a single box is possible and I think in our last box I think our last box were again I don't mind losing that content because the, the pulls were really bad I think we only got one secret rare and it was a um, a kaiju card that really wasn't that good got a trickstar fusion and then Cyburst Converter, Summon Over, and Subterra Guru, followed by Time Thief Winder. So yeah, that was very disappointing. Um, but hopefully we can bounce back strong and pull another, some really good secrets. So let's see, we got the Legendary Six Samurai, Prank Kid Roxies, Shinobi Necro, Unisong Tuning, it's a funny art. And then our first ultra rare is Sharanui Skill Saga Supremacy. Put this one off in the front. And then Fire Fire Charmer. I actually think that's a pretty good uh, rare as well. And then Clock Lizard. Definitely think uh, this is one of the kind of like sets that cater to my liking as far as the art. Just a lot of cool, cool uh, mech dragon kind of things uh definitely infinity chasers was not my thing sure new sword master and then spectral sword shade raptor squirt squid and then time thief hack and cybers converter all right so we did get one ultra rare so far so we have to hit that secret for the side of the box all right time thief hack Neo Space Connector, Lost Time, Share New Swordmaster, and then Thunderclap Monk, and then Guard Dragon Shield. All right, pretty weak pull so far, guys. Um, no, no Garmeads, no. Can't remember what the other Guard Dragon common is. No, no Sunlight Wolves, no Boral Loads. All right, let's see. Performer Pal, Clay Breaker, Salmon Great Paro. Ooh, there we go, Garmeads, nice. And then a Agrippin. And then Maldoche, Salaman, Great Wolvie, Sure New Squire Saga, and then Cyburst Wicked, and Time Thief Regulator. Alright, we're moving right along. Sort my piles real quick. Let's 
So as far as Yu-Gi-Oh goes, yeah, it's been a roller coaster ride where we started off super strong with uh, our Savage Strikes and uh, consecutive, consecutive, consecutive um, Phantasmes, and then Infinity Chasers like was a super dud and kind of like came down to like the last half box where we we had some redemption. Um, and Speed Duel, actually, I, I did watch a couple videos of Speed Duel. I do actually like the idea of it where it kind of like simplifies the game i feel like the or especially in the beginning like the meta doesn't require that many cards the, the cards are super cheap um and yeah so it's actually pretty cool uh however just the as far as like opening i feel like it's not great for opening however that's not a bad thing like maybe that's just a ooh solomon great sunlight wolf nice um that's perfectly fine if this is kind of just geared towards very casual players that I feel like that works perfectly um, and so that, that and so by far it sounds uh, Savage Strike was by far the best and so I don't remember what the next set coming out is but I do have did uh, pre-order some of the stuff uh, so looking forward to that and then there's more speed duel like there's just so much coming out in Yu-Gi-Oh um, We might try to get a couple boxes of dual power I feel like they're kind of expensive though where you get six packs only six packs for like $30 And here is our next ultra rare in Cyber's quantum dragon Not a great hit guard dragon cataclysm red right I do like that art Converse Converter and Sir New Squire Saga. Uh, so we'll definitely be. I mean, I'll get definitely get at least one box, but uh, it just feels like it's pretty expensive. Or you don't get that many cards. There's a lot of really great hits in there, uh, but I'm just not that confident about the odds of getting those good cards. Sir New Style Solemnity Child's Play it does have like a really good, a really nice um, alternate art of Dark Magician. Which is, looks really cool. All right, this art I also really like. And then Black Iron Sea, Red Rising Dragon, and then another Promesis. Nice. Is it Promesis? Yeah. All right, down to our last two packs. So far, all we have is a Sunlight Wolf to show. This is not a secret, right? Yeah. All right. Hopefully, we get at least a secret rare. That'd be super disappointing if we get another, like. A half a box without getting our secret but it wouldn't be the first time all right sword saga guard dragon core awakening tg tank grub and then a elemental hero cosmo neos all right comes down to the last pack for the secret rare come on come on don't disappoint me all right here we go is this going to be another terrible box I actually bought these boxes in case I highly doubt it matters where you get the case from but uh, the four boxes that I pulled four phantasmes were all on eBay and then these I got from Amazon because they still had a very competitive price and I have to imagine like they're they're sealed so nothing could they couldn't been like tampered with or anything so we got prank kid Roxy's all right all right all right psychic wielder that's that is a secret rare and that is a very good one so, all right, that, that came in pretty clutch, I'm not going to lie. And uh, so if you guys have been watching our previous Yu-Gi-Oh! videos, this guy is a very good omen. So we've pulled, this is our fourth one, and three of those, basically the next half of the box, yielded that Phantasme. And then the fourth one, I think, I don't remember what secret rare was the other secret rare we got, uh, but it was, it was another good one. So, but every single time we pulled Wielder, we pulled Phantasme next. So, um, came in pretty clutch, and I'm optimistic about wrapping up this box. So, stay tuned for the next part of the Savage Strike box. And uh, so, pretty good half. Um, and uh, so, if you did enjoy this content, definitely let, let me know by hitting that like button down below. I feel like our Yu-Gi-Oh! content is starting to gain some traction, which is really nice. If you're new to the channel, uh, welcome. Be sure to hit that sub button and as well as the bell for notifications. We do primarily, uh, every single day we do a Pokemon video and we're starting to mix in some Yu-Gi-Oh! content. Uh, whenever the next Magic set, War of the Spark, which I'm super excited about. I had an awesome trailer. Um, even if you're not into Magic, definitely go check that out, especially if you like Linkin Park. Um, 
definitely when that set drops we'll be opening some magic the gathering and uh, whenever we require some new new cards we'll be doing mail days every once in a while for all three of those card games uh, so um, with all that being said guys that's it for, that's all we have for today I'm a wanted turtle and I'll catch you guys next time peace